ability to threaten some area that maybe your opponent doesn't think that you can hit. Mm -hmm. And yeah. But, but yeah, the great punish on the uh, canine there. Just, like you said, he was doing, trying to avoid getting back to ledge. Mm -hmm. But now we are in grand finals, people. Did it really happen that fast, guys? We're already in grand finals. Mm -hmm. Nico and Razo. These two players also play a lot. <laughs> yeah, but now we got all this, all this momentum from Razo now. Like he's he's kind of in the zone. Nico's been killing it with um, Falcon lately. He's <laughs> he's been pulling out some uh, some uh, shenanigans, I would say. Oh, neat. Okay, he, I think he could have gotten that. He just missed the. Uh, it. It's, it's kind of, it's a lot trickier than you'd, see, you'd think to land that knee off of Nair 1. Mm -hmm. it, it's a pretty tight window. Great anti-air uh, anti up smash. Yeah, that, that tipper hitbox sending him super high. Oh, great fair catching jump. Yep. Razo now has the lead against Nico. But Nico does, I don't think he really cares if he's ahead or behind. Yeah, he's just going to keep doing his thing. Mm -hmm. um, a little late. Razo. He was a little late on throwing out that turn up and he couldn't extend his combo. Okay, there. There's a fair it's, coming out. It's just him fall, falling down. Yo! Oh, he just hit him with the... the <laughs> he did the, he the frying, frying pan, pan yeah. Into the, into the turn up. Yeah, but you see he was... That almost killed him. Oh, he just... Just throw out two strong matches. Upside just so good. Hit him, Falcon. Yeah, that move. It's really strong. Like, Nico told me, he's like, Yo, I looked up the frame data for, for Captain Falcon up smash. And I was like, whoa, this move is busted. So now I just spam it. <laughs> you know what? That was a low-key pretty good impression, Nico. <laughs> <laughs> like, the speed pattern, pretty on point. Oh, got him with another up smash. <laughs> Yeah, there goes another up smash. I mean, oh doesn't care. Wait, his, it was so it was so far behind, and he brought it all the way back. They're dead even. This guy doesn't care what percents are you're at. He's gonna up smash you. Oh god! Just constantly. Please don't get hit again. Attack. Okay, oh. he's dead. This should be the stock. Oh, he's gonna make it back somehow. It, and he did. I still think he's gonna make this back. Mm -hmm. Just like, yeah, he did. He's gonna win not this fair. game too. I can just feel it. Nice. Like not. he shouldn't. Nah, he's not. You don't think so? Nice parry. Not. Okay, he might. <laughs> <laughs> it's like really scary. He, well, if he get, oh, he, he got the lucky. The fair comes out of the corner. Oh, okay, that's dead. Oh, okay. I was wrong. Yeah, he, like after the first one missed, uh, Nico tried to go, like try to retreat away, and then uh, he got hit. Got really bad. Yeah. Oh my god. Granted, that bear would like kill like 8 out of 10 times. Yes. Both of these characters have very strong bears. Mm -hmm. I don't remember which one you were talking about, but uh, the just peach. go ahead and say that. Okay, yeah. <laughs> peach is bear. Peach is bear. Oh no. Oh yikes. Oh, 74. Okay, Sorry. yeah. Goes low uh -huh. there to. He waits out the dare. You know what? Razo should do. He should just get. He should just go off stage, like be directly in front of that platform, right in front of the ledge, like with his body. Draw up fair, and if he gets hit by the the command grab, you tech it and then he fair and then he dies. Yeah, the only thing with that is that if you if he goes high, so I mean that's great when that's uh, Falcon's only option. Mm -hmm. But if he goes high, then you just kind of give up save stage control. And Ross has been getting like a lot of mileage out of that. Yeah, but like, there's also the the other issue of fair hits really high above her. <laughs> like, that is true. Yeah, but it does take time to get back to ledge. Yeah. Um, also, oh great like, counter. I think in a lot of these situations, uh, when when Falcon is forced to go low against Peach, he's Pretty much dead anyway. Mm -hmm. uh, nice. 
Oh, but you can really continue it. That port's out with... Ooh. Oh. The air dodge worked. Yeah, I mean, air dodge is actually, like, I think a really underrated option in this game because it gives you so many options. Like, sure, it has a lot of lag, but you can air dodge in any direction in this game. Mm -hmm. But that fair gonna take it out. Oh, no, don't get hit. Oh, no. Oh, no. 73%. Yeah, okay, so he is intentionally getting that weak hit, I think. Which is also really hard to do. Uh, okay. Oh, Brazo with a lead, but, you know. Oh, there we go. That he was a little high on the command grab. Oh, spot dodge can't beat up smash. Two How hits. How does Nico do this every time where he's down, like, this much? And then he somehow brings it back to where he's almost going to win. And in some cases does. And that's just kind of the Jake of Falcon. Ooh. Oh, there's the bear. Throw it right back. Run it back. <laughs> so, uh, Razo taking that game pretty convincingly. <laughs> and, uh, some, some fun gameplay going on right now. Very fun. But Nico, if he loses this game, I wonder if he'll stay. You wonder if he'll stay Falcon? Yeah, if he'll stay Falcon. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's going to go to Falcon. Yeah, me too. I mean, he, he showed his hand earlier when he brought out the character. I think he's just trying to push Falcon as far as he can right now. And if he feels like he can't push him any further, he's just going to bring out Nico. And he's just doing the classic grand finals, you know. I basically have a set to play with, so that's what I'm going to do. But against Razo, I think this is a little dangerous, because Razo is good enough to where he can definitely beat uh, Nico Schultz. Yeah, he can. He has done so many times before. But he could also lose the cap to Falcon. Yes. <laughs> like, yes, both, both, both timelines are very, very valid. In fact, Nico can probably bring it back. It's just going to be very difficult. Oh. Triple Mare. Mm -hmm. That's this character. Oh, the fair's not going to break up. Eh, not going to poke the shield up well enough. That's going to go high. Yeah, Razo, I think a lot of these mm -hmm. situations, he just prefers to go for these pokes and edge guards where he throws out a turn up, which kind of fades back and then tries to catch the landing. Yeah, I think that's... Oh, the what? <laughs> that command grab was really weird. It, like, hovered back for a half second, too. Um, like, it was... Like, actually, if you've been, like, kind of noticing, Razo's been getting a little, like... Like, he's been getting a bit braver. Like as time goes on, like he he'll get the turn up out, he'll throw it up, and then he'll go slightly off stage, to try to like uh, mess with Nico, and then he'll try to hop back in. Oh, that's really oh, awkward. No. Oh no. Oh, yeah, he didn't get the last hit there. He could have comboed that in the fair and uh, I think. Uh, Nico would have been dead. No, he wouldn't. Uh, it it would have been a weird spot, and it, it would basically be another edge card situation. He was only at like 49. That, like, I, I would be surprised if he died. There to me. There to me. We've seen these so many times. Time and time again. And uh, Nico clawing his way back into this one. Mm -hmm. Making sure that each one of these games is as close as possible. Oh my god. Oh, that almost worked. There, he's dead. Low. He needed to run a little bit. I don't. Oh no, he's not. He got. Oh, that was a great air dodge back on the stage. Oh, uh, just right. going it's for the fair. The Ooh, the no fair. snipe. Great recovery is coming in from Nico. Okay, good stash attack. Oh, oh wow. Oh no 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 <laughs> no no hold up hold up hold up. Oh, there's a fair. That's not gonna kill. That's not gonna kill. Opposite side of the stage. Oh, he's though. dead. Yeah, this time he's dead. Where? It's in the beat there. 205. 205. <laughs> he got the winky face one. Yeah. 
That's like the one I want to die to the least. <laughs> like with the with the zoom in too. Yeah, the zoom in. <laughs> that's the that's like the most peach thing ever. I feel like because she's like, oh, did I win? Oh, yeah. Give you the winky face. But she, one of her cons is, she li she literally says winky face. Is that what she says? Yes. I'm so glad I played Daisy instead. <laughs> He's pretty BM. <laughs> Oh, he's sticking with the Falcon, though. It's game one. Okay. And it was I pretty close. I just feel close. like he, I don't want to give Razo a set if I'm Pico here. You in a game? Game. Yeah. Well, you just gave him a set. Mm -hmm. okay. Neither is improbable. But then again, I've never won one of these, so I'd be like all in, dude. <laughs> like. Like, I'd be like, I'd be a hunched over gamer stance in my hair, chair, so sweaty. Be like, yes, this is my moment. Hey, dude, these, these guys, both these guys have been here before. Yeah, that's like, true. Razo, Razo's taking this game 100% seriously. And like, he definitely, I'm pretty sure he wants to win. I know Nico wants to win too, but like, he wants to win it with Falcon. <laughs> like, it, 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 it just, it gives a whole nother statement, right? I do. In, in a way, like, An Nico's like, statement. yeah, and, and like, Nico's low-key proving a point. <laughs> like, I, will, I will, what point is he proving? No, the character's done. All right. <laughs> I mean, he did, it would have be, been a stronger point if he won the first set. Yeah, well, he won the first, no, he did win the first first set. This is, he lost the second one because, when he won the winners, and then he lost the losers. And he, only, he lost the winner set of grand finals. This is the third set. All right, fair point. Yeah. So like, it, it's still like even. It, like, he could still win. He could still win this set, I mean, like this tournament, with kind of yes. playing nearly all the rock rock. <laughs> You've been the flight of Falcon there. I I really feel like more players need to do that. Just get that tech and just kill him. Mm -hmm. Oh, up smash. He, he kind of, I think he was going for that, but he couldn't. Oh, if you're going to go for the tech on the up B, you need to like tech and then hold back into them so that you'll get the tech jump and then you'll be able to hit them. Yeah. That was just a normal tech. Yeah, he did a neutral tech. There's a forward throw. Off stage. Oh, got him with the two frame. And there's a fair. That's it. Uh, Nico actually died because he jumped in. <laughs> well, he was... I was going to say he was really far behind, but we saw him win one of those games. Yeah. But he hasn't been able to close any of those out against Razo since and, that first game. Yeah, since the first set, it's been a bit harder. Yeah, and now Nico's going short. Yeah, but he's throwing away a game here. Could cost him. Could. But he, he did it for the experience, you know? For that Falcon experience. Mm -hmm. Just like, what kind of crazy person ma made Shulk and secondaries Falcon? And literally only this guy. <laughs> And Joker, he secondary Joker as well. Oh yeah. Oh, it's a long way. But he likes Joker. That's the difference. <laughs> yeah, he likes Shulk too, right? Yeah, he likes Shulk too. But not Falcon. Nah. <laughs> he plays him ironically. Oh, that I was a good counter. That, but this is ridiculous to me. Oh wow, what a read. That was the for glory read. Yeah. Forward smash the other way, they're gonna roll. Yeah. <laughs> <He's> bet. <laughs> Give him a little charge too. Uh-huh. That's how you assert dominance. Mm -hmm. Just like you just give him a little bit of a charge, just showing Two you up know there. exactly how long they're vulnerable for. Buster. Fun fact, in Smash 4. Shulk had landing up air at 30%, and it led to another up air, and it was a kill confirmed. 
Yeah, but Shulk wasn't as good in that game. Nah. But he still had some dumb things about him. That being You're one of them. Wrong. <laughs> like the, like the, the, the triple up air attempt, that kind of reminded me of the Smash 4 days. Oh, it breaks through the turn up there. Yeah. And that second hit of the dash attack. Four throw. Gonna look out for Raza. Oh, and gets yo, the yo, stitch. Yo, yo, yo. What are we talking about? Momentum changer. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yep. Oh, great high recovery. Yeah, I, Peach is one of those characters, she can kind of wait out a lot of the what Shulk wants to do with the ledge. So when he has that smash art, mm. uh, you can just kind of float at the bottom. You can maybe use the parasol if you're feeling in risky. all re In all reality, if Razo wanted to, he, he could pick and choose whatever Monado he wanted to deal with. Like, he... Yeah, he could like kind of hit them. He could box them. He could, but he could also just kind of float away and like force Nico to respect his like his like distance, because like as soon as Razo decides to land with Nair, like that stuff that starts to train. That's the but the problem with that though is once you give Shulk space, he puts you in the corner like this, and that's just like such a bad spot to be against Shulk because he can just pressure you, and if you're at a higher percent, enough percent, you can put it in smash mode and just kill you. Yeah, that, that, you, that is a problem, but like at this percent, at 67, you're not going to die unless he turns red. <laughs> oh. And, and like you, once you see him turn red, then you still camp him out. Like <laughs> Yeah, once you ha he has you in that corner, though, there, you can't camp him out. You, you have to deal with all the hitboxes he's putting in front of you. Yeah. It's like... This character, once this character has you trapped at the ledge or towards the edge of the stage, it's so scary. Oh, can't go, can't get these bears. Oh, but the great up smash read. Said, I, he learned a few things from playing against the Falcon. <laughs> Said, I got those too. <laughs> I too can throw out up smash. Yeah, I mean, that's a great move for when you think your opponent's gonna drift over you, or you can kind of run forward if you're expecting your opponent to approach with an aerial mm -hmm. and just get under it and, and kill them. Uh, it's good for, if, like if you think Mario is going to full hop back air you, God knows why, but uh, you know that works because it extends out his hurt box a little bit mm -hmm. and you can get under it. Oh, it's that down throw, immediate switch into shield art, into immediate switch into s speed art. Back air into dash back air. Very I weird. That looks so cool. Huh? Uh, the, uh, he just da back air and into the dash attack. You uh -huh. get that? I think that looks cool. Oh, that he would have. He would have been put in a really bad spot right there. Right. Order. Both these characters have like really interesting things. Both these, <laughs> both of these characters are. To put it. Both these characters are very high APM. Yes. Like, like they are, like they're they're pressing buttons, like a lot of extra buttons that like to set them up for something else, like another situation. Like Peach needs to like press like three different buttons in order to float cancel into aerial into land. Shulk needs to hit, he's hitting them while simultaneously switching his arts into once, like into buffering it, like while landing. Right, and into you're, you're holding the direction of the Monado, that yeah. you're, uh, Monado art that you want. While simultaneously still trying to drift in the certain direction you want to be in. I got blown up earlier because I called them Monados, not arts. Yeah, they're arts. <laughs> Uh, we, we stuck Monados back in a, the Smash 4 days. But, yeah, they are arts. The Monado's the sword, that's why they like it. They like it? And, like, that, that, that's why they don't like the name. That, that's why it's confusing to the audience. Oh, got him with the fair. He's off stage. What is he going to do? <laughs> Actually, Almost got hit by that turn up. Not like, no, honestly, that throwing that turn up up. Uh, is really good because like it sets him up for a two frame because it can two frame him. And, oh like, yeah. It, it would put him in a really awkward spot and then Raza would just go off stage. 
bop, hit him with the fair. Yeah, it's it's or, a. Or he could just throw out another turnip because he had another turnip in hand. Oh, that was a hard call out. Something that I've kind of stolen from Razo when I play is like I just chuck turnips up when I have my opponent in a situation where they're you know off stage or they 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 have to deal with it. Mm -hmm. Um, it's just a great way to pressure your opponent and make it their recovery that much more difficult. And I guess I didn't even know they could do for him, actually. So yeah. That's probably why he did it sometimes. Yeah. Also covers a higher recovery as well. Yeah. And, like, let's say they, they try to delay their recovery and they recover low, it also covers that, too. So, like, you have a really weird timings that you have. Like, if you're going to recover early, you need to recover low. You're going to die killed. Razo just took it. Yeah, that's... Oh, he wait. Just, wait, hold on. That was a 3-0. Yeah, he did 30. He did already 30. He Get those canceled fast. forward. Just hit him with forward air. Oh, my God. And that's the end of the tournament, everybody. Yeah. So, first tournament here in SoCal. There might be another one. We're just going to say this is the first one. For what? With Terry. Yeah, this is the first Terry tournament. Did I'm you not, forget? Uh, I, no, like, I just, I, I didn't, like, think of that as a thing until you just mentioned it right now. But, <laughs> alas, everybody, that's the end of the tournament, everyone. Yeah, thank you so much for joining us. Thank Hope you, you had some fun. Hope you liked our commentary. We did. Uh, you can follow us at Twitter. I am uh, at Mr. J underscore Rogers. And I'm at Jack the Mac, M-A-C-K, six. Yeah, it's gonna. You oh could, my god, my hair is crazy. Yeah, it'd be Take like us that. to the skies, dude. Get us out of here. Deuces. <laughs> <laughs> Javi was about to come out here. Did you want to say something, Javi? He, Javi speaks. You, you, did you call Rashido, like, as I was standing up? N uh, he did. Oh, really? Yeah, well, the camera came to us. Yeah. And my hair is crazy. Yeah, I was just going to, like, adjust it and just have you guys talk for a little bit. But, hey, okay. Rashido's Rashido. Bye. Rashido. Uh, bye. -bye.